Hello guys, I'm the Darth Frog and welcome to a review of the first version of Space Map. And first I'm going to show you guys how to install game files version. Okay, so once you download the file for the link in the description of the mod and unzip it, you get that folder inside. You have three files, as you can see. With me, you can you can read it, but of course, many people won't read it. Okay, so now go to your Steam and right-click on Scrap Mechanic, click Properties, Local Files, and Browse Local Files. Okay, now right here. Get go into space mod game files part on and copy both of those files to here. As you can see it asks you if you want to replace files. Click yes. Okay, so that's how you install the second part of the space mod. If you want to you install it or what you gotta do is just do the same but with off. Just when the game is loading you can already see a difference. For example right here, instead of Isola there is Helmet. And right here you can see much much difference. So yeah let's load the game. Here you can see the difference as well. Once you're already in game, you can see that almost everything looks completely different. So, the sky has no atmosphere as you can see, you can see stars all around. And of course, player model has changed as well. We're now an astronaut with a nice antenna. And mod description, there's also a link to that rocket already. You you can of course build it for your own, you have all the parts in here. But yeah, you can download it from workshop, scrap rocket as you can see with Soyuz because it has that vehicle inside. So I'm gonna show you, you can also download that vehicle from the Workshop, all links are in the description of the mod. So yeah, you can see here, it's steering and stuff. Of course, you can make this one for yourself as well. You have all the parts. You have the sand module. All the stuff. Here is the orbital module. Yeah, I know it's because of sand and. One more important thing if you're building it for yourself. Here is the propulsion module. And that thing is has smaller collision. So you can put all the stuff inside as you can see. I have a lot of things inside here. Such as stabilizers and stuff. Okay, so actually you know what? Let's start launching that rocket into space. So, once you spawn it or build it for your own, like that, and you weld it to something like that, then you have to place a button or something um, connected to this thing right here and put it on the highest level, I think. Yes. It won't work on lower levels, because lower levels, at least for now, are like normal thrusters, so yeah. There was no point in setting them, but if you place on the highest level, click the switch, you go to the orbit. That thing over here actually is 
This is not space station, which you have link in the description. So you can just go up and build your space station easily. At this height, you can also already see that we're slowly going into space. Can you see that, guys? We are going into space. And we are in space. Isn't that great? So, about that space thing right here, you probably see some weird stuff going on. The galaxy isn't going around. But it's because it's meant to be not normal galaxy, but colliding galaxies. And yeah, you know, you probably know, you should know at least what I mean. And you have very important block, which is information block. So when there is, for now it says basic information, but once there will be update for the game files part of the mod, information band will be told right here. So yeah, keep an eye on it from time to time. No, it might be worth it. Force field block. So what this thing is, is basically totally 100% invisible block. There's a block right here. You won't be able to tell. It's pretty hard to build with. And it's made as buttons so you can find it with connection tool. So yeah, as you probably know, Durf made invisible blocks some time ago, but it wasn't 100% invisible. So yeah, here you have 100% invisible block. So yeah, you can make for some floating platform. And yeah, you can see, you can even see it right here. So yeah. Also, one more very important thing is to have code race up because otherwise it doesn't look that good, to be honest. Then it doesn't look that good at all. Saya so, yeah, spacecraft. Okay, actually, let's do that. Start those. Okay, so it's stable enough so we can walk on it. So now let's deploy our solar panels like that it looks great for me we are remember to check out also other creators channels they will appear at the end i was dark frog see you in the next video bye